and be able to take this and apply it and take it back to my team so my team can really gain the experience just like I was here. I'm so excited to be a leader that can live to lead. One of the main takeaways that stood out to me most was the um, quote from one of the speakers that talked about giving 60 and receiving 40. To me, that speaks volumes. I was very empowered today. The event itself was very impactful. And I'm looking forward to next year already. One of the speakers talked about having a passion for people. And that's what it's all about, just having a passion for people and being available to serve others so that you can really influence those that you're leading. One of the greatest takeaways I got from the session was the fact that it's all about people, inspiring people, growing people, investing in people so that they can become the best that they can be. And uh, leadership, as we said, is not just something you do in a vacuum, but it's a lifestyle. Uh, shaping people, growing leaders, is something that you do from sunup to sundown. And uh, that's most important because uh, impacting the world doesn't just happen in a few hours short, you know, a short few hours span. But uh, it's something that goes on and on and on because life is continuous. People are always uh, going to and fro. And so leadership is, it has to be at, at the forefront. Some of the speakers, they spoke about serving leadership. They spoke about serving people, about putting your people before you. And um, authenticity and leadership, those are some of, the, some of the things that stuck out to me, some of the elements that stuck out to me, but more so the, the elements on servant leadership. This is Deborah Capers yes. and Connie Vivid. We just finished uh, Live to Lead, an amazingly uh, successful uh, event. Many takeaways. One of the goals was to give a high quality event, a high quality um, experience where as a, uh, every participant will walk away with nuggets, with ideas, uh, with things to act upon, things to change, and things to teach uh, someone else. I'll ask Deborah, what was your highlight for the entire Live the Lead experience? Wow. It was a wonderful, awesome event. And my takeaway was the importance of leadership and how it's really needed. And leadership starts with serving others. It does. And I think it starts from the inside. And I think several of the speakers were saying when it starts on the inside, it would definitely show up on the outside. But the, the venue, the meal, the participation and the speakers, it was just an awesome event. Just what Albany, Georgia needed. <laughs> Here today, and that's leaders go first. Mm -hmm. And it's not mm -hmm. about me. Mm -hmm. So I, if the leaders didn't receive anything else today, I think that servant leaderhood from the sense that it's not about me, it's about my team. But when I become my best, then my team mm -hmm. can become their best because I'm sowing into them. Mm -hmm. But can I just remind you again, it's not about us, it's all about you. All so about as John you. said today, we have to do what? Step into leadership. <laughs>